Good morning, everybody. How are you today? Pretty good here. I don't need this anymore. Had to fuel up on a little bit of Mountain Dew this morning. Ran out at home, had to stop at the old gas station and buy myself a bottle of Mountain Dew. Um, so anyway, I wanted to get on here and talk about, uh, are you bored with your Toyota Tacoma? Do you ever get bored with your truck? You know, I must admit, probably part of the reason uh, that I've had so many vehicles is because I get bored with them. And I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm a little bored with the Tacoma right now. Now, not as far as really the truck itself or, you know, having the truck or anything like that. I don't mean it like that. Um, I don't mean that I'm ready to throw in the towel and go get a, a I don't know, a Honda Ridgeline. You know, I, I don't mean anything like that. I mean more from, I guess, the way that it looks, particularly in the rear end right now. I'm kind of bored with the rear end, if that makes any sense. You know, what I have on the back, and I did a video previously talking about, thinking about uh, doing something with the bed rack back there. But that's what I have on the back right now. You guys can see it through the rear view there, um, or through the rear window. But that is the, the bed rack that I have on. You know, it's, it's honestly, it's not turning out quite the way that I, I had envisioned it um, fully. Some of it has. I mean, I have the running boards on there, or the, the uh, recovery boards, I guess, which is cool. That's exactly how I thought it would be. Um, I had thought about putting more stuff on it, but the more I think about it, uh, I, I don't think I'm going to go that route. I think I would rather have everything contained within the bed, if you will. I don't want it hanging off the truck like it is right now for a couple reasons. One, I just don't like seeing it. I don't like seeing it off the edge. I thought I would, but eh, as time has gone by, I just don't like seeing it there. And it's not that there's anything wrong with it. I don't think it's a horrible look or anything. I think it it honestly makes the truck look maybe a little bit more rugged, but just not what I'm looking for. And then when I think about putting other things on, it's just not, not what I want. And then secondly, um, the visibility a little bit. It blocks the visibility right there in the middle. Uh, it's not a lot, but to be honest, when you first glance back there, instead of looking through the, the window, you know, to see what's back behind you, the first thing that catches your eye is the top of the bed rack. Now, that's not a big deal because like I said, it's like this thick, right? So you just have to refocus, but it's that split refocus part that I'm not really digging. So I am gonna go ahead, I had mentioned before thinking about it, but I am gonna go ahead and replace it with something else. Uh, most likely it's going to be some sort of a sport bar, something like that. And I call it a sport bar because roll bars, you know, what you get these days, unless you go all out, have something fabricated, bolted to the frame, all that good stuff. It's really not a, a roll bar. Uh, they're really just a sport bar. They're to make the truck look a little bit sportier. And I know some of you might be thinking, well, gee, if you were looking for a, a sporty truck, why did you buy the off-road version? Well, first of all, well, first of all, I wanted the off-road version, right? I've had the sport a couple of times. I may have had the, the off-road one time in the past, but I don't think I ever have. So I wanted to try the off-road, and I'm happy with the off-road. But I also think you can jazz it up a little bit, you know? Make it look a little bit sportier, a little bit edgier than just the off-road version. You know, the, the Tacoma, particularly in the off-road version, is kind of a cool looking blank canvas, if you will, right? It doesn't have that scoop in the front, you know, the, the faux hood scoop up there. Um, and it doesn't have, you know, the, the badging, which I guess is irrelevant because I take the badging off, so that doesn't really matter. But it's a blank canvas, the off-road is, that you can add things to to kind of make it the way that you want. And that is what I really like about the off-road version. So when I say that I'm bored with it, I'm not bored with the truck per se. I'm bored with what I've done to the truck. Uh, for me, it's time to make some more changes, kind of sport it up a little bit. You know, I want to have ultimately a sporty looking TRD off-road truck. And I think that can be done with just a few bolt-ons and stuff. You know, everything is bolt-ons anyway. I mean, 
you know, when it comes right down to it, that's what you and anybody else, if you're concerned about that, are going to see is, uh, you know, what the bolt-ons are. Okay, we have, oh, I guess a semi that's, that's turning. I don't know what he's doing. You never want to pull out in front of anybody, uh, particularly down here, because if you do, you might get to know them a little bit more intimately. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to do. I'm going to kind of schnazz up the truck a little bit. I'm going to replace that... Uh, roll or not roll bar but the bed rack in the back i think it's time i think it's time to move on do something else back there um, and still be able to incorporate the other features that i wanted you know a lot of the recovery type stuff bug out type stuff emergency type stuff things like that i might even put some kind of a storage unit of some sort in back there uh, it's not going to be anything that's going to take up the whole bed or anything and it isn't going to be any kind of a pull-out drawer or any of that kind of stuff. But who knows? I don't know. It'd be kind of cool to have something back there that I can secure, uh, probably through that front bed rail maybe. We'll see. I don't know. But something that I can secure back there and, uh, and be able to stow things or bring things with me and not have to worry about somebody else deciding that they should be theirs. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, leave a comment. Let me know. I'd be curious. Uh, if that ever happens to anybody else out there, you ever get bored with your truck? Not that you'd want to get rid of it, not that you want to get something else, because it's definitely not my intent. My intent is to keep this truck until the wheels fall off. But with the way that it looks, or maybe some of the mods that you've done and you changed them out, I'd be curious to know. Also, real quick, if you're interested, check out my other channel. It is Rob Motive JT all about my 2020 Jeep Gladiator. Don't forget to click that notification bell so that you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. And do me a favor, smash that subscribe button on the way out. Thanks for watching. Stay safe out there.